Good afternoon traders. It is Thursday, January 28, 2016 and the U.S. stock market is closed. Well, you look at this Dow chart, does it not kind of look like a roller coaster? Uh, yeah, it really has developed a roller, roller coaster pattern and that pattern continued today. Uh, the Dow opened up real strong right at the beginning of the day and um, and then it failed uh, looked like it went decided you know significantly negative down here we hate this kind of pattern because typically what happens is we get long positions up here and then they go to hell and they did in fact go to hell down here the fortunate thing the Dow found support down here. Uh, we've seen that support last two, three days in this area. It bounced back up, came down, tested that support area again, and then it put on a pretty good rally here and actually uh, took out the highs that it made right at the beginning of the day and then pulled back just a little bit. But uh, strong finish for the Dow. Uh, up 125 points and if I'm just looking at and analyzing the Dow chart here and nothing else uh, this is a good pattern uh, if you happen to be bullish as I am it, you know it looks real strong and I think this kind of sideways roller coaster uh, pattern in the Dow we're seeing it's going to resolve itself here pretty darn soon and it's going to resolve itself to the top side. Uh, this is a bull market and we're going to see uh, a continuance of the bull market here pretty darn soon. Uh, but this is hard to trade. We uh, managed to make about a thousand dollars a day at least if you uh, compare closed out with uh, open trade. So it wasn't a terrible day for us, but uh, these are kind of scary patterns because they can end up costing us a lot of money if they go wrong. Uh, so I'm not. I I'd like to see uh, the Dow resume a more um, pronounced upside uh, movement. I'll show you uh, a couple of the trades here. We had. Uh, this first one is TVIX. That's one of two of these VIX-based uh, stocks that we trade. They're, they're ETFs based on the uh, VIX index, volatility index. Some people call this the fear index. I mentioned yesterday I have these in the portfolio because I believe it's a hedge against a market crash. These things are going to scream topside if, uh, if, if, the, if the market did in fact crash and we could offset uh, losses with them. The problem is they're just like any other stock you can get tagged in them and cause losses and they are pretty volatile and with, as I say we have two of them. So what happened yesterday we got tagged in uh, these things right toward the end of the day and then they backed off a little. These losses we had on the close yesterday they didn't mount anything but look at this huge gap down this morning. This had me uh, almost running for the bathroom. These were down five thousand dollars a piece on this open total ten thousand dollars. That'd be pretty rough. Fortunately they popped up a little but we still got out uh, you know $2,500 a piece or $5,000 total and that's what set us back in terms of our exits today. We did in fact um, close out negative about $5,000 on our close out trades uh, on our exits this morning. Uh, fortunately we got in to some good couple good stuff and we're carrying positive six thousand dollars 
in, uh, going into tomorrow. So technically, you know, we made a thousand bucks, but we got to see what happens to tomorrow to make sure we actually made that. Uh, show you the one good trade we have today. This is a brand new stock for us. It's Run Sun Run R U N Sun Run, and uh, I'm not sure what happened here, but we bought the pop uh, this morning it went against us right away didn't look real good something happened here look at this bar we had in here and then it pulled back but then it actually recovered almost pretty close to the high there on Sun Run we're holding uh, over six thousand dollars in open trade equity in Sun Run so that real looks real good I, I had a good feeling about today. I'm pretty happy. Uh, we'll see what happens tomorrow. This is Trader Bob. I'll see you tomorrow on Friday.